Thank you, Alicia. I will now call for the opposition summary from St. Rose Modern Secondary School, Janelle Joseph. Mr. Chairman, judges, audience all, good afternoon. Mr. Chairman, I am here to cement my team's position and allay all doubts that you may have had before this intellectual discourse. We are convinced that human resource development is not the key to raising productivity levels in Grenada. Our first speaker will have taken you on a journey where she will have outlined that human resource development in a vacuum cannot raise output levels. It is with this in mind that we propose that the key to raising productivity levels is the utilization of various factors to affect the rate of output. Mr. Chairman, please hear me when I say that this is not a deliberate attempt to exclude human resource development as an influence on productivity levels. But it is not the key. By itself, it is pointless to argue with a clear conscience that it is. All factors will not affect everyone in the same way. That is why there is a need for an amalgamation of various elements that can lead to a rise in productivity. A blend, Mr. Chairman, of many ingredients that must be stirred and mixed together in the production part to result in an elevation in outputs and efficiency. My first speaker also stated a need for higher prices for our products investment and job opportunities to exploit the skills of workers in order to improve output as well as use of incentives and to encourage them to work and work hard. As well, fair for performance propels want to increase their output to gain the financial rewards. As the saying goes, if you pay peanuts, you will get monkeys. You were further persuaded by our second speaker as she explained to you how work ethic and raw materials can be used as part of the recipe to increase productivity levels. Productivity is affected by the mindset towards work in Grenada. The indolent attitude that infests our businesses and organizations are intolerable. The work ethic and courage is illustrated by lateness on the job, frequent breaks, procrastination, and downright laziness. Unless this changes, Grenada with all its newly minted scholars, experts, and so-called professionals will not be able to increase productivity levels. The proposing team may have tried to mislead you into believing that human resource development is the key to raising productivity levels in Grenada. But audience, don't be fooled by their perplexed utterances. I know you are smarter than that. I am sure that you are now convinced that in order for us to raise productivity levels in Grenada, we must employ various factors to achieve this objective instead of relying on one factor. I can now depart this stage knowing in my heart that my team and I have converted all the skeptics to the acceptable way of thinking that human resource development is not the key to raising productivity levels in Grenada. I thank you. Thank you, Janelle.